Hi friends, my name is Rohan Barachandra. Welcome to today's breaking news where we cover the finance and economic news of the country. News number 1, Sirma SGS listing details. This IPO was opened between 12th to 18th August. Issue price was 220. Today when listing it was 260 rupees so 18% higher and the closing price was 311 so 41% above the issue price very very good listing for the IPO. It was subscribed 32.61 times during the IPO period. It collected rupees 840 crores out of which 766 crores was a fresh issue which will be used for expansion and working capital requirements. News number 2 Adani Green's high debt ratio. Adani Green's debt to equity ratio is the second highest in Asia. Its debt to equity ratio is 2021% which is second compared to China's Datang Huan Electric Power Company which has a debt to equity ratio of 2452%. If the company's business does well, it will be able to pay off its debts in the coming years. Or else it will become like Anil Ambani group of companies where they had high debt and their business did not do so well so they could not repay the loans and most of the companies are almost closing down now. News number 3. PM Modi's opinion on work hours. PM Modi spoke at Labour Minister's conference yesterday where he said that flexible work hours, particularly for women, will be the future along with flexible workplaces and work from home. He wanted more women to provide their services to the workforce which would help in the further development of the country. News number 4. Rapid News. Supreme Court raises the ceiling for mining in three districts in Karnataka, Bellari, Tumkur and Chittadurga. In May 2022, Supreme Court had lifted its ban on iron ore from mines in the above districts which it banned in 2011 due to environmental concerns. Titan Company is planning to open its first store in the US this year. Now moving on to today's stock market update. Nifty went up by 36 points and closed at 17,559. Sensex went up by 59 points and closed at 58,834. Point number 2. Today's top Nifty 50 gainers and losers. Top gainers, Grasim 3.1% up, NTPC 2.83% up, JSW Steel 2.82% up, Titan Company 2.69% up. Top losers, Aishal Motors 3.63% down, Intercind Bank 1.85% down, Bharti Airtel 1.37% down, Asian Paints 1.16% down. Point number 3, today's top Nifty Next 50 gainers and losers. Top gainers, Sale 2.45% up. Adani Enterprises 2.39% up, Bank of Baroda 1.91% up, Avenue Supermarts 1.58% up. Top losers Bandhan Bank 3.63% down, Pyramal Enterprises 2.56% down, Lupin 1.83% down, Procter & Gamble Hygiene 1.56% down. Point number 4 Advanced Decline Ratio for NSC Advances 1122 stocks declining 838 stocks so 57% up, 43% down. Point number 5. Yesterday's FII and DII investment data. Foreign institution investors, 369 crores worth shares were purchased on a net basis yesterday. Domestic institution investors, 334 crores worth shares were sold yesterday on a net basis. Point number 6. Today's gold and silver price. Gold price, 4,770 per gram. Silver, 61.3 per gram. Point number 7. Today's rupee value. 1 US dollar 79.85 rupees, 1 euro 79.81 rupees. Point number 8 Stocks near 52 week high. Adani transmission 52 week high 3785, closing price 3751. Bajaj Auto 4124, 52 week high, closing price 4054. Mahindra Mahindra 1299, 52 week high, closing price 1275. And Siemens 2968, 52 week high. Closing price 2,920. Point number 9. Stocks near 52 week low. No major stock touched its 52 week low today. Point number 10. Global queues today. Hong Kong markets 1.01% up. Japan 0.57% up. Germany 0.16% down. France 0.1% down. UK 0.01% up. And Nasdaq US 1.67% up yesterday. So this was today's breaking news. If this video was good, please click the like button and mention in the comment section, do you like work from home or do you like to work from the office? Please mention in the comment section. 
If you like this video, also share this video with all your friends. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye and all the best.